Last week I invited a bunch of people to come down, so I don't know. We've got one guy, he's a crossfitter here. I'm not sure if he's uh, competing in the challenge or not, but I'm getting ready to warm up for my workout. We'll see what happens over the course of the hour. Cool thing, got this wrapped up. Back to the Olympic lifts. Chris is stretching right now. Stretch out his tight ass hips. I'm just warming up, so we'll see what we'll see what happens. Where the hour takes us. Ugh, a little bit of loss of flexibility. Here's this guy. What's going on? What's up, man? Hey, how you doing? Thanks for filling us out, Rio. No problem. What's your name? I'm Nick. Hey. Elliot? Yeah, nice, nice to meet you. you. Yeah, real cool. Ricky. Ricky? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, brother. Cool. I'm just warming up here. What we'll do is, since you guys don't necessarily have a plan and you're not really doing the challenge, well, I'm just gonna put you through something. Is that cool with you? Yeah, that's cool. Put you through something. Let me see if this other guy, Wes, hang out here. Yeah, we are. Uh, so fill that out. And these two other guys, they're just, they just came to fucking hang out. I'll do whatever. But um, what I want to do is give you a chance to feel the medicine ball, yeah. feel the farmers. Have you done farmers carries, Prowler? Not really. I've done Prowler, but not farmers carry. All right, you're in for something, brother. Oh, okay, that's not really work. That's not really strong, man. Nah, I'm fucking with you. All right, cool. When you're done, come out here. Cool, you guys warm up and stuff. Just get your bodies ready. The first thing we're gonna do, I'm gonna get you guys in the ball. Take. Take. Yeah. Warm up and shit, though. Take care of your body. All right. I haven't lost too much flexibility. Believe it or not. I thought I would have lost a lot of flexibility. I didn't stretch much the past two weeks. I'm not doing a lot of volume on this. I'm just gonna hit uh, three sets of three and then I'm just gonna get, get some heavy pressing and shit. Done with uh, Wednesday legs day over there. <laughs> nah, that's actually no day when legs day. Not too bad. Last time we did these, Chris and I went built up to 110 kilos, which is like 225 maybe. Actually, more it's probably like 235. Uh, I'm in the restaurant right now, and I just got a job working with kids at a rehab. Nice. So I'm doing that. I started what kind of rehab. Um, drugs and stuff. Yeah. So uh, I start that this when week. You say actually. Kids, how old are they? Um, like around 15, 18. 15, 18. 18's when they age out. Good, man. That's fucking dope. It's good that you can do that. Yeah. That's, really that's, why, that's exactly why I wanted to come here, man, and meet you and just be surrounded with because you're so motivating and stuff. So I want to be able to take that energy and give it back to them, you know? I mean, that's really... That's, that's the demographic that I talk to a lot, too, you know? 15, 18 to 35, you know what I mean? On the younger end... Good they got guys like you to help them out. You know, you have, were you addicted to drugs at any point? Uh, well, no, I wouldn't say drugs like that. But I oh. used to smoke and, you know, I was drinking a lot, but nothing, yeah. nothing bad, you know. Yeah. But yeah, I actually went to that program twice, so I'm glad. Well, yeah, I'm glad. I'm happy to go back and be able to, to give back because those people made a difference in my life. That's dope. Yeah, that's what I figured. You, giving back. Yo, so check this out. Take this and just mess around a little bit. We'll get you guys doing some other cool shit. Ugh. Oh, it rained this weekend, I think. So all the marks are gone. Oh. Dude, are all the marks gone? Le Le Lehman Land and McGinland. All the way back here. They got flooded out. Yep. Yeah, move in front of the line just a little bit more. Cool, we're, we're, yeah, we're front, man. Ain't easy, but that's pretty good. Huh? Yeah, 
can't be tough. We'll see. Cool, see what you got, dog. There's a lot to do with it. Cool, man, yeah. That's Chris there, yeah. Yeah, I, I got one more set of three. Just getting comfortable in that position overhead. I just gotta do some snatch balances and shit. I'll walk with this weight till I get really comfortable with it. It's like shit, that's alright. Yo, everybody thinks we live in, everybody thinks we're in California or some shit. Yeah. These guys are like, really? You live in St. Petersburg? <laughs> Hell no. Yeah. To you, and then it popped up LA Hall Straight Camp. I'm like, no, this has got to be a hoax. This is fake. <laughs> you guys want to give this a try here? Yeah. Cool. Plan. So, just watch me. Best way to do this, just come here. Pop. If you get to a point where you can't, can't do it and get stuck, just drop. You gotta save it, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Just drop the shit. <laughs> That's 90 plus 50. So what is that? Uh, 140 pounds? Yeah. Nice job, dude. Wes, you want to give it a shot? Hop in there. You just got to get comfortable with it, dude. It's so awkward. I know you talk about that pop a lot. Yeah, you got to pop it up. Hit, just hit five of those. Yeah! Come on. Come 
on, man. Good, there you go. Nice work. Hey, feels good, right? Yeah. Yo, that's the thing about strong man. Rule you. Yeah, you feel like a fucking man. It's pure attitude work, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's so different than most of the stuff we do in the gym. You guys, where are you? Like, you go to the Bulls gym or? LA right now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I love it. It's a good gym. How long have you been training? Oh, uh, this time around, like, two months. Oh, you just? A two and a half. Fresh. Yeah. Yeah, I did a bunch of stuff in high school. How old are you guys? I'm 23. 21. Oh, uh, 22. Yesterday, two days ago. Fresh! Saturday. Damn! <laughs> I used to be a little fight for that. Let's just go, let's put these on. Okay, do that silence. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Good, nice! Yeah, yeah. Try the 25, do, put that on and do another one. Alright. I got one of these too if you got more. Alright, Take it up. What's up? Yeah, what'd you do earlier? Then uh, squats, six by six, and then uh, six by six. I'm yeah. Burnt out. Then uh, seven sets of two snatches, pull from the floor, pull from the head. And then I did a Y. It's about 90 pounds lighter per hand. Hey, look. Come here. It's 
Stand inside, chest up, stand up, take it to the trailer, turn around and bring it back. Good, nice. Looks good, dude. You know what it feels like, at least. Basically, that's like, that's almost like 100, right? Right there, basically when we measured it. Yeah, yeah, just about. Bring it right back to this truck. What was it, Rob? Ricky, my bad. Okay. Let Ricky take it again. Cool. Into it, right? Feel a little bit lighter. <laughs> Cool. That's why I want to try and move as fast as possible, huh? Yeah, cover I mean, that's the, the key is to cover as much ground as you can. So if you go faster, you're holding it less, less time. Listening to uh, uh, Mind on Fire. Yeah, I have the book. It's a big book. It's thick. Yeah. I know. But the audios are like eight, eight, eight. It's like like 24 hours worth of music. Really? How you doing? Damn, I gotta, get, I gotta get that. That'd be a little easier than reading that big. Ass I listen thing. to it while I'm walking. Sick, man. Yeah, Wes. Are you guys doing a challenge? Uh, I'm thinking about it. Ah, uh, nah, then you're not doing it. It's already sold out. What's the challenge? I just wanted to throw that, that ball up. Yeah, well, let's go, go right ahead. So that's what these, this is what these guys hit already today. Take it, just throw it behind you. Give it a shot. Make sure you're warmed up and shit. And you filled out the paper for me, right? Yeah, so you fuck your shit up. I'm not, I'm not liable. <laughs> I did like a two-mile walk. Two See how my hand holds up here. I'll take these gloves off. It's gonna peel it up. Ow! Huh? Nah, I'm a dick. I'm just gonna fuck it up. I should probably just don't do it. It's like it's healed, but. I, I, I don't know if I can split it open or not. Yes. One way to find out. Nah. Fuck it. Yeah. Hey, hey man. Ah. Not bad. Not good, but not bad. <laughs> there you go, bro. Speed matters right now, man. Cool, yeah. If you get past that line, like that's basically like average, you know, yeah. you're doing pretty good. That'd be a good goal, goal to reach. That's it, man. Nice. Make it happen, dog. Where do you train? Uh, I actually train. I have a own gym. Uh, it's like an outside gym. Oh shit! Yeah, it's a. Uh, it's called Rise Fit. Yeah, in Tampa. Yeah. Pretty cool, 
man. It's like on an acre lot. I build like uh, monkey bars, pull up bars. I have so a book. You, you own the, the acre? That's dope. That's so cool. You run classes out there? How many class? Like it's just you or you got employees or other coaches? Uh, just me. I'm just a trainer and like owner right now. That's How cool. long have you had that? Uh, a little less than two years. Oh, all right. Cool so now. you're established. Yeah. Cool. You want to hit this, lo hit this log before I put it away? Oh, yeah. That's true. I know you guys are a little bit later, bro. Good job, Olga. Yeah, man, good. Good How much that one What are you doing next? Uh, I'm gonna let these guys try the farmers if they want, and then we'll, we'll finish up with the prowler. Good job, Olga. Done over right? You did 10? You're banging out, man. Yeah. You're here. Listen, you're here. Might as well work hard. Is that? It's only the volume's not that much. You guys are done on the farmers? Throw, uh, leave a plate, a plate, a plate, a plate, and then put four plates on this. Nice work, really strong. That's probably not what I'm supposed to do. Right? It's alright. <laughs> that was good. I'm just leaving these out if you guys want to mess around with it. Also, I'll leave that there too. What we were doing was we were taking it down to the um, trailer and back. Right now we're just going to finish up with these. I'll bring it back high handled. Yeah! Wow! That was it. Hey, one move. That was good. Good, good around. Yo, where's Mario? Yo! Mario, where's Mario? Where's Mario? Action is measured by the sentiment from which it proceeds. All right, all right. I love that. That puts it all together. Yeah, you've been using that word a lot, sentiment. Yeah. I'm a big fan of that word. <laughs> <laughs> How like, about yourself? I like uh, persist in your path, and though you forfeit the little, you gain the great. You demonstrate yourself, so I put yourself out of false relations and draw to you the firstborn of the world. Beautiful. That one. Excellent. Guy, his, his words are like medicine. Yeah. It's like strong it's medicine. Who's that? I mean, Ralph Waldo Emerson. But yeah, it feeds the soul, that's for sure. Which is What's the one? A, full, a, a foolish consistency is the hobgoblin of small minds 
and in little stations and um, divines. He calls them divines. I think he means like priests and stuff. I think he, I think the rest of the word he used divine. Okay, you take Oh, done. Thanks. Clean me, Derek. I'm not really playing with them. Let's do a couple of sets. Let's go. Get your little butt down. So it's just, it's just a little bit heavier than what you're gonna do yeah. in March, but um, you're better off training over, you know, training heavy. Yeah. Show sure the distance of this. Heavier? Yeah. But it's up to you. Yeah. But fascinating, huh? Yeah, they had a pretty fascinating relationship too, but someone asked me yesterday, said, um so push. it seems as if everything that needs to be Come said on. has already been said. Come and on. what could philosophers of today possibly have to say? And I think about Emerson because at the time people said the same thing. They were studying the, the, the Bible. Yeah. They were, he was one of the first people to study the Bhagavad Gita yeah, and the yeah. Vedas <laughs> and to bring it and yeah. blend it in. I think what the I think what the philosopher of today does is he, he he has the capacity to blend, yeah. to take from multiple different places, exactly. and that's blend all together. Emerson did really, you know. That's all he did. He's just, just such a voracious reader. Yeah. He's able to put all that shit he learned into concise essays, you know. <sighs> Who's the French guy that he read, De Bach, or? Um, I don't know. He was super into Saint Augustine. He was into Plato. Plato, uh, yeah. He was into uh, who else? Descartes. I don't know. Maybe. Hume. He he fought with Hume. Quite a bit. Um, he was into. Uh, uh, you mentioned Saint Augustine more than anybody, really. But he had a. He had a yeah, leak a little bit. That gives me so much permission sometimes. Yeah, exactly. I feel like, am I retarded? Yeah. Or does everybody just not get it? <laughs> <laughs> it's easy to be like, there's got to be something wrong with me. Yeah. But he's right. Yep. Um, and I think the other thing too is like being able to take these ideas and like Thoreau does, like actually like, okay, they're ideas, they're abstract, they're poetic, but how can you make that shit happen? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you actually live that? Can you actually do that? Yeah. That's where the value is. Back in those out. days, it's a lot easier probably to do that. We're not so many distractions and, and uh, temptations as today, you know. They didn't have fucking uh, computers back then, you know. They didn't have cell phones, so. And the thing is too, our, the collective mind has become so aggressive because back then, like, you'd have an idea, you'd write about it, but it might be months, maybe years before anyone gives their feedback. Yeah. Now it's like, people are gonna watch this tomorrow, <laughs> and, and feed, instant feedback, those guys are retards, or you guys are brilliant. Yeah. And then it's like, it's yeah, difficult right, to have right. your own ideas, Absolutely. like pure ideas, without it being infiltrated by yeah, other people's yeah. shit. This is cool, man, thank Definitely. you. I gotta get you one of these before you leave, all you guys. 
Thanks. I don't know if it's gonna fit my my fat wrist. Got it. There you go. A lot of those greats, they didn't become great until they were long dead. You know, they were ahead of their time most of the time. I mean, Emerson did, he was lucky, but a lot of the other philosophers, they didn't. Yeah, um, so, so true. But yeah, today it's just a faster world. You know, nobody, every, what did Biggie say? Biggie is a philosopher. Yeah, he said. Right? That. You're Don't. nobody till somebody kills you. <laughs> That's the truth. Yeah. All right, yes. Hey, man, when we ever get to come back? You ever get a chance to flip the tire? Yeah, we'll do that. You set the bar, man. I'll try and knock it down. Yo, you guys, use your knee to kick it. Dang. Going that way? Yeah, just go that way. This is 400. 400? Yeah, well, how, you guys have one, right? You have, yeah, what is it, like that side? Okay. If you can lift it, then I probably can't too. That one's. I use my like strength by his strength. Yeah, yeah the, the black plates go all the way by the garbage can back there. Right. Thanks. Walk it out. Then I'll try. She, um, she did farmers. Too. She did the log. She reminds me of my cousin. I don't know if you know my cousin. Uh, oh, we want the strong Angela. Yeah. You gotta get her into a strong man show. Let's go. Stick with it. Stick with it. Stick with it. Good. Ah. Yeah, man. There's a big difference. Oh, yeah, it's night and day. It's two totally different things. Come on. Come on. You got it. Come on. You got it. Hell yeah. Nice. You're a beast. Woo! Yeah, that was good. This board is not meant for big beasts. Oh, you didn't think I could do that, huh? So practicing every day, Chris. Damn. What do you do? Oh, you yeah, want me to man, teach you? It. It's the it's the shoes. Right, bitch, I'll do an ollie higher now with, with, no, oh! with no shoes. I'm gonna bust my ass. Yeah? Uh, oh you guys all know about this shit. I don't even I, I don't even know how to get on it. Last time it was the hand. Now I've never been on a skateboard before in my life. Oh yeah, you're done. <laughs> right behind the bolts. Right behind the bolts. Put it back here. And then you bring it up. Once it's back, you bring it up. And then go out. Some cute sandals, dude. So. Oh, what do you call that? Can you see it? Damn, what was that? That was sick. Ollie one foot right there. Ollie one foot. That was the one foot Ollie. I'm making shit up. That's all this is. That is, man. Okay. That was pretty tricky. Try it. Try it. Try it. It's pretty good. I hit a Bart Simpson. I'm done. I'm done filming you, bro. Mm -hmm. I'm done filming Chris. Don't don't worry. He's doing the same trick over and over. Thanks. Oh. Um, two, just in case. <laughs> yeah, my pleasure. All right, good shit. Uh, ready? Nice. Thanks. Got it. Get out of here.